Hello everybody, I'm Dan Valkov from Educofin, the trader who brought the Heiki Nashi over from Japan, developed it and made it available to the trading community in the West. Hope you had great and sunny holidays and are looking to more and safer profits in the markets. Let's be clear from the beginning. Nobody wins using one or two formulas. Profits are the result of a rigorous setup mixing mind, risk and techniques. Most of you have tried Heikin Ashi by now. You found it useful, profitable, and it is already in your portfolio of techniques. But whatever looks simple is not easy, and Heikin Ashi is no exception. I'm looking forward to meeting all of you in Milan and discussing about how to apply Heikin Ashi better. Since the time Heikin Ashi became public, many ideas came up, but all I know about them is that they have a problem. It's called lag and lags are very dangerous because we don't know what's around the corner. The quantifiable Heikinashi solves a great deal of this issue. Together with the protective stops, results are improved. But this is another topic for discussions. Can a trader use only Heikinashi and protective stops? The answer is positive. Is this a recommendation for trading? It depends on you whether you accept it or not. People are different and the risk is subjective and personal. In trading and investing, there are no unique solutions. Heikinashi is one of them and remains on the table. My focus is on losses, so we'll discuss about Heikinashi and stops. My other focus is on anticipation of events. Heikinashi is great when we deal with warnings, positive or negative. Realism in trading is another sp spot I focus on. Capital, mental preparation, and uh, risk management. All these variables complement entries and exits. Unfortunately, many are ignored. We'll also talk about forces that always, and I repeat, always, are against you in trading with or without Heikin Ash. I'm looking forward to meeting you in Milan, expecting a constructive dialogue, sharing experiences, good or bad, about Heikin Ash. Take care and have a safe return to your business and markets. And don't forget, September is the worst month for the equity markets and October is the crash month. See you soon in Milan and uh, arrivederci a tutti.